Everything you've learned in Photoshop up to this point has helped you develop the skills needed for a productive workflow. From setting up your workspace, creating a working Photoshop file, then learning and using all the various tools. Well now, here's the last thing you need to learn. Outputting your files. In this lecture, we will be going over the ins and outs of how to get your Photoshop files ready for whatever output you need. You spend a lot of time creating your Photoshop images and making them look spectacular. Now you need to make sure that they stay that way no matter what output you choose. So let's get started. The learning objectives for this lecture are to begin to understand the importance of preparing images for printed outputs, to identify key tips and tricks for printing, to demonstrate an understanding of key printing terminology, and to optimize files for various forms of output for both print and digital outputs. So you're done, now what? It is always best to know what your output plans are for a project before you start editing. An image that you want printed is going to have a different set of requirements than that of an image destined for a website. In this class, some of the project you, projects you worked on in the previous modules needed to be set up for inkjet printing in this module. So we made sure to outline the specific size and inches and resolution and pixels. These are some of the basic requirements needed for this specific output. And this is what we're talking about. This lecture will focus on what to do when you're done with the design, assuming all of your prep work has been on the up and up. However, a lot of what we're assuming you know about preparing an image was covered many weeks ago during lessons one, two, and seven. So let's take a few minutes to review file formats, resolution, color mode, and color management 101 before jumping into the new content for this lecture. We have noted here that if you're comfortable with these topics, jump ahead to slide 30 in the lecture or hang out for a good and thorough review. This will be video five in our series, which is actually the sixth video in the playlist. 